Hey, magnificent beings. So, what did I want to say today on this little vlog from Bali as I travel around? What was very present yesterday for me was this sense of self-love, right? It's a big thing in the world at the moment, especially if you're in the self-development world or in your, whatever you want to call it, different labels that take us somewhere. But something that came out yesterday was, and I've been sharing this stuff for years, right? If, if you've been following anything that, that you've seen, it's like all been pointing back to self-love, right? Why can't we love ourselves? What is blocking us from loving ourselves as we are right this minute? And it came up so beautifully yesterday in a sharing that we did, me and a beautiful man had this sharing and all this noise and all these reasons why we can't just love ourselves as we are. Like when you sit in inquiry and you do your meditations and you just sit in silence for a while and you look at the constructs of the mind and you look at the thought patterns that are going on and on and on that are coming from your subconscious, the repetitive dominated thought patterns, at some point with that awareness you have to see them as false, right? Because anything that tells you you need to do something, become something, be more or achieve more or get some sort of certificate award or some success or have some money in the bank to love yourself right now has to be complete poppycock because if that's the case then you potentially are in the position that you are never ever going to be able to love yourself because if you think I can't love myself because I need to lose weight or I can't love myself because I've got crooked teeth or I can't love myself because I've got no no toenails right or I can't love myself because I'm not the right size or I can't love myself because my beard is grey or I can't love myself because I don't have a partner or I don't love myself because um, uh, I've got a hemorrhoid, right? You know what I mean? I, I have a hemorrhoid at the moment, yeah? It's like, it's, it, love is not about all this stuff that's going on. Like, at the very essence, you are the source, right? It's like, you know, I can't love myself because I've got diarrhoea. I can't love myself because all this stupid noise that's going on. So today I just want to fire that up from the sharing and put it out there. And please, if, if you resonate with this, because there's lots of talk about self-love, lots of books out there in the world and everybody telling you how to love yourself, but ultimately, you shouldn't need to be told how to love. Just like, you know, it's like, it's like who you are, right? It's like, at the core, you're this divine expression of life force. You're a miracle. You don't even know what you are. You can't describe yourself. There's so much going on in your heart, the, the, the blood that's pumping around your body, everything that's happening before you, you did not actually do yourself. And ultimately, you're here, part of it all, right? So, if that's not enough reason to love yourself, just the fact that you're breathing, just the fact that you're, you have breath coming through you and you're here and you can witness, if that's not enough, then ultimately everything else that you're telling yourself you need to become or be in order to love yourself is false, in my humble opinion. So, if you're hearing this message today, stop what you're doing, stop everything, check in, go to a mirror, look in the mirror, a long mirror, stand in front of a mirror naked and just start to observe yourself. Not just your physicality and start judging all that, but notice the judges, judgments you might have, but just start to see beyond what you are seeing and see that you are a miracle. And that in this very moment, you are enough. You are worthy, you are able to love yourself. And if you can't fully love yourself and you can't fully see yourself, Please, as an invitation to whoever's watching this video today, wherever you are in the world, I invite you to drop the expectation that somebody else should see you and somebody else should love you. It's all here. It's all here. It's so easy when you realize that you are the one that can love yourself, because you don't have to go anywhere. It's so easy when you realize it's all here and you don't have to go outside of yourself. So, boom, bit of a longer vlog today from Bali. Hope you're having fun wherever you are. And I hope you can see that magic and that wonder that you are and love that miraculous experience. This blip of dance here. Oh, 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 oh darling, so good. And this Jai Ganesha, elephant, stone, who knows? Ciao.